And Norris fans! My hands are still cold from today. It's okay. My hands are still cold in Just the warm My hands are cold in the My hands are cold in the I have to be fine. I have to be fine. I have to be fine. And I want to. Just on our way home, and uh, we picked up a little straggler. Is what this our... another poop joke? Let's see who our guest of the week is. Boop, 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 <laughs> this is hey, it, hey, this is it. This is our first uh, special guest I'm appearance first. on a drive time episode. That's right. You're outnumbered right now. We got uh, two Canadians. Oh, yeah. Now. What are you going to get? You're going to take me out in the woods and we're going to out nice me to death. James, uh, you just got here a couple days ago, right? Yeah. Nice. And how have you enjoyed yourself in the first few days of shooting? Good. Uh, they have me living in the same house as Rob. Hey! Hey, bum, 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 bum. Aren't we having fun living together? Um. Um. <laughs> didn't you tell me, <coughs> James? Didn't you tell me once that? Sorry, uh, sorry, Rob. Sorry. Did you cough more during this show? I don't know what's going on. I lost my voice for two days of screaming in the movie. Uh, today, all day, I've had this cough. That's a that's a that's a mystery, all right. Boy, we had a detective to try and figure <laughs> put the pieces together. If you could have one superpower, what would it be? I want to say invisibility, but I feel like that's, yeah, that's pretty rapey. That's the choice of the pervert. <laughs> you guys are really the glass half empty kind of people. The and glass? I'm sorry, did you say we're the you glass know, half empty people? Your superpower should be uh, learning the English language. <laughs> that would be great. I know how to kill people. <laughs> That's your superpower. <laughs> I put a lot of thought into it. Mine would be teleportation. But you love you love to drive so much. I do, but things would just be so much easier if you could teleport. Uh, flying wouldn't be an issue. Uh, invisibility wouldn't be an issue because you kind of just go in and then teleport and be gone. Freeze time. You can get out of any bad situation. Truly, you can even stop. Even if I'm like, click, boom, bullets right there. You're freeze like, freeze time. But you could freeze teleport time. away from that too. It just got so stinky in this car. Did you shit yourself? Oh, landfill. There landfill. Just did you? It. It's right there. Did you poopy? Yeah. Did you poopy yeah. your pants? Yes. When was the last time you pooped your pants, James? Everybody wants to know. They're, they're asking on Twitter. I've never done that. Like, been so drunk that you shit yourself? No, or just, just accidentally shit yourself. Okay, you and I are going to say at the same time when the last time we pooped ourselves was. I'm going to say full one. Full poop or like a really bad shark? Uh, full poop. One. Two, three, go. Six Tuesday. years ago. I think the last time I pooped myself, okay, this is a true story. When I was in uh, early high school, I had a, um, a paper route. And I used to have this problem. Like I always had to be near a toilet because I was, I just had this fear that I was going to, I was going to shit myself. And so halfway through my paper route, I would always like get this anxiety and I sort of knew a kid from school halfway through my paper route and one day I knocked on his door and uh, he wasn't there, his parents were there. And I, I had to basically go to the door and be like, I know you guys don't know me, but I'm friends with Scott and uh, well, I'm not, I mean, I'm not really friends. I mean, we, we have like class together, but uh, I really need to use your bathroom, would you mind? And they were like, uh, okay, sure. And I was in there for, I think 25 minutes and Scott never talked to me again. I love so much about that story. <laughs> What's the worst thing you've ever done, James, Kate? I had a paper route when I was a kid, and a, ba a really bad work ethic, and uh, I was delivering papers, uh, and this one guy was like, hey, this paper, he threw it at my door, he's supposed to place it, and then I killed him. Is that the kind of thing you mean? Um, 